Megan Angerman is the lone female fighter pilot in her squadron. You know, I came in the Navy, there were no female combat aviators. There were no female aviators allowed on the ship. Uh, and as my time in the, in the Navy, that has changed. There's been growing pains. You know, I think some were very uh, well publicized. And, um, but every, every organization in the Navy, as females have come into, the, into their organization, have adapted. The introduction of women into the cockpit of Navy aircraft was controversial from the start. Wave off power. Raise your gear. Raise your gear. Power. Eject, eject. The Navy's first female fighter pilot, Kara Haltgreen, was killed in an accident in 1994. The final report attributed the crash to both an engine failure and pilot error. At the time, some people questioned if the accident was linked to her gender. Now, more than a decade after that accident, female aviators like Megan Angerman are commonplace in the Navy. How's it going? She's a nugget on her first deployment to a carrier, and according to her skipper, she's a good one. She actually was, uh, and I don't want to embarrass her, she was the top five nugget in the air wing for the entire cruise. In other words, uh, uh, she was the fifth best uh, in landing performance on the aircraft carrier for the whole cruise. So, yeah, I'd have to say she's a pretty good nugget. <laughs> 